Tonight we are live from Doak Campbell Stadium here in the state capital as tonight the Florida Gators meet the Florida State Seminoles. Hello again everybody, I'm McCubert. Welcoming you to another exciting Saturday night of Florida Gators football. You call it what it is, we block what it is, and everybody's on the same page, all right? I want to see you go out there and play with a lot of energy, a lot of effort. You stay in the game with me too, all right? Communicate with each other. Understand where the tight ends are stuck over here. And have fun with it. Fly around and have fun. There's great tradition and rivalry in this game. The Gators and the Seminoles as they meet for the 61st time. It's second down and five. Fullwood motions across the formation to the left. There's three receivers left, and the Gators run the ball, handing it off to Scarlett. He tries to veer off to the left side and get a first down at the 35-yard line. He's at the 40 and up just about to the 43-yard line. He almost busted that one loose, but he runs it out for 13 yards and a Gators first down. Scarlett is just coming into his own, started up the middle, and just did a magical job of running that ball. Scarlett in a one-back set, first down at the Gator 43-yard line. And now here's a give off to Callaway and an end around to the right side. He's to the 45, he's to the 50, in FSU territory the 40, turning that corner and inside the 35-yard line and out of bounds on the Seminole 34-yard line on a beautiful run that time by Antonio Callaway. Snap to Appleby, Appleby dropping back under pressure, swings it up to P. Ryan. He makes the catch to the near sideline at the 15, at the 10, inside the 10-yard line, out of bounds through the 7. P. Ryan swung out to the left, headed up the boundary, and Appleby let him have it, and P. Ryan almost outran everybody to the end zone. All right, here's Eddie Pinheiro. He's 16 for 20 this year on field goals, and this is going to be a 38-yard attempt from the right hand. There's the snap, the set down, the kick is up, on the way, and it splits the uprights. Gators with four down linemen digging in, three linebackers. There's the handoff to Cook running off the left. He's brought down on a beautiful tackle out there in space by Caleb Brantley. You've seen this with the Gator defense often. They start adjusting to the things that were beating them early in the game. Right now, these runs with Dalvin Cook, there's a whole lot more Gators there waiting on him than there was in the first quarter. All right, so here's Ricky Aguayo, who's hit tonight already from 22. This one is 44 yards, left hash, there's the set down, the kick's been blocked! And the ball squirrels down to around the nine yard line as the Gators got in there and got the block of the field goal. What a great play, and Ivy jumped up there, 6-1 or 7-1, doesn't matter. He got up there and knocked it away. What a huge play. There's the snap to Francois, and the quarterback is going to run the ball to the left. And, and he's brought down on a tackle up high. Daniel McMillan grabbed him around the pads and just tossed him down. Snap to Francois. Francois back pedaling, now standing up, throws the ball down the field. It's intercepted. Chauncey Gardner at the 42-yard line, weaving his way off to the left. He's at the 30-yard line, coming to that far side. Gardner running down to the 27-yard line, and the Gators have their first takeaway tonight on a Chauncey Gardner first career interception. All right, Eddie Pinheiro, 41-yard field goal try between the hash marks. There's the snap, the set down, the kick on the way. It is good. Inside that left upright, Eddie Pinheiro drills the field goal. Francois under center, gives the ball off to Cook, and he's brought down by Caleb Brantley, who got in there and made a very fine tackle at the 44-yard line for a loss of one yard. Caleb Brantley making his presence known often tonight. Murray comes up, makes the catch inside the 20, and he's going to be brought down. The ball comes out. It's going to be picked up by the Gators, and they're going to score a touchdown. Marcel Harris recovered a fumbled kickoff, and the Gators get the touchdown on a special team score. Oh, my. Johnny Towson kicks it, and I have to give Chris Thompson a double A plus for getting down there on the coverage, stripping the returner. So it was Marcel Harris that picked it up and took it to the end zone. Francois takes the snap and now is going to run the ball and he takes off at the 50, at the 40, and he's hit hard and knocked down by Marcel Harris who came in there headhunting and knocked him down. The ball came out. Marcel Harris hammered him with his shoulder. It was a great play by Marcel Harris. And Florida State has beaten the Gators tonight here at Dope Campbell Stadium. Our final score, Florida State 31 and Florida 13.